are you? I hear you. Okay. I was trying to do the Aquarius, the, yes, the Aquarius reading and literally, okay, I have to show you, I pulled up a lot of the cards, um, but the sun card came out, the king and queen of wands came out, wands is all about fire, the strength card came out twice, that's the Leo cards, and it was like, Leo is dominating this fucking reading, right, and I'm trying to read for Aquarius, but I can't, because Leo keeps intercepting, right, and it was, that's never happened before, where it's just so fucking strong, so, I was like, I went out, I smoked a cigarette about it, <laughs> um, and I, and I heard these wind chimes, I heard the rain, and it came to me, and it was like, you need to le read Leo. So, <laughs> here we are, I have to gather all of my fucking cards, <laughs> get right back on, on board with this, <laughs> um, because Leo has something to say. Um, so I'm going to use the deck that I actually got from a Leo. <laughs> um, so, yeah, let's, let's see. Wait, hold up. Okay, yeah. Um, okay, yeah, so it just never fucking happened before where another sign dominates so heavily that I can't even read for another sign. <laughs> it's like, there's a message here, right? There's something trying to come through, and... Maybe there was a Leo cross watcher or something, but I was like, I don't, I don't do readings for cross watchers. I do readings for the signs. So you need a reading for you, right? Um, so Leo, let's see where you are. Okay, first one out, Knight of Wands. Wands is fire, right? Back to that fire shit. Um, and if you're a Leo, you know that's your element. Um, this means that you're rushing in for something. You want to communicate something, right? You want to talk about something. Eight of Cups in reverse, okay? So it's like you've been unable to come forward with something here. And you really want to talk about it. Um, you feel like you want to offer a cup, but you're unable to, right? Cup is, cups are all about love, emotions. Um, eight is all about mastery and knowing how to do that, <laughs> right? Um, also very Leo energy. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Uh, so, uh, let's see. You were just stealing that fucking reading. And I was like, none of this makes sense. None of it makes sense. <laughs> and I couldn't get it. I couldn't figure it out. But now I, I fucking see. And I'm like, okay. So we're doing your reading. All right. The Wheel of Fortune. Something's changed here. Nine of Wands in reverse. Okay. So, you've noticed a snake. Right? You've noticed a snake. I see the snake very heavily in these wands. Um, entangling itself with you. Right? And it's really preventing you from this Eight of Cups. It's preventing you from offering your cup. Um... And you have to let them go, right? That's, that's like you notice the snake, you gotta let it go. Alright, so, let's clarify the Knight of Wands. What do you want to come in and say? Right? Because I know you want to say something, because you fucking dominated that, that reading. <laughs> Poor Aquarius, they've been waiting. <laughs> Apparently, your, your message is a little bit more important right now, I think. Um... So, we'll get back to Aquarius when we're done with Leo. <laughs> um, but, yeah, okay, so Knight of Wands. So, 
six of cups. All right. Yeah. It's something that you love more than yourself. Like, I see two cups in her hands and then three cups around her and then the one around her neck um, is like, it's like on a, a chain here and it's pouring out. It's like, it's like trying to give love to everybody, trying to please everybody around you, right? But then sacrificing yourself in the process here. Um, sacrificing your own love in the process of trying to please everybody. And I feel like it's fucking getting to you. Um, all right. Eight of Cups in reverse. Not being able to offer the cup you want to. Because you're so busy people-pleasing. of swords you know you have to cut something off right and it kind of brings me back to that nine of wands in reverse with the snake and also look at that sunshine in there the sun is the leo card all right um so yeah you have to cut something off you have to master honest communication here you have to be honest with yourself about everything you have to be honest not only with yourself but with them with this snake <laughs> about how you cannot <laughs> you cannot <laughs> all right wheel of fortune what's changing for you what changed something changed right something shifted here where you you fucking changed wheel of fortune Knight of Cups. Yeah, in reverse, sorry. Um, yeah, so the thing that changed here is not being able to um, come forward about your love. Right? Because Knight of Cups is all about coming forward and offering a cup of love, right? Cups is all about love um, and emotions and feelings and all that shit. So what changed is you were not able to do that. And... Let's clarify the Knight of Cups in reverse. Are you able to now? Like, now that you're starting to see the full picture. Now that you're kind of done people-pleasing. Because <laughs> I think you've noticed, like, nobody's suffering except you, right? It's like where you thought you had a victory because you were pleasing everyone around you, you realize that was actually your loss, because everyone around you is now pleased, and you're not. The moon, yeah, you discovered something here. You discovered something. Something, like, there was deceit, there was something hidden from you, right? And you illuminated it. Um... You saw something under the surface here. You saw things that were happening in the shadows, in the darkness. Nine of Wands in reverse. Judgment in reverse. Yeah, so this is somebody that you didn't want to pass judgment on. This is somebody that you really struggled to see the truth about them. Um, and you dealt with a lot of bad karma as a result. Um, you just... Alright, let's see. Alright. So, what is Leo going to do?
Well, he's going to do the Queen of Cups, apparently. <laughs> That's what came out. Uh, as an answer to my question, he's going to do the Queen of Cups. <laughs> um, or she. Um, I don't know. Could be male, could be female. But what you're doing is this Queen of Cups. <laughs> Queen of Love. Somebody who you see as, um, as it, you know? Somebody who is just sitting there holding a cup. For you. All right. <laughs> well, congratulations. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay. Um, all right. So then, with this Queen of Cups, that's at the forefront of your mind. What do you need to know moving forward? Okay, King of Wands, Leo energy, King of Fire. Um, things can't move forward with this chariot in reverse. They can't move forward until this Three of Cups in reverse is taken care of, which means um, ending a friendship, right? Um, letting go of somebody who you once thought had your back, but you discovered something about them, right? And with the Six of Swords in reverse, it's like you struggle to let them go. You struggle to cut them off. Okay. But I did see that you were going to do the Queen of Cups, so maybe you are going to let go of that friendship that was holding you back. You know what? Alright. So what's the energy of the... Because clearly this is at the forefront of your mind. You completely dominated my last reading. So what is the energy of this person that you want to move towards? Right? Five of Swords in reverse, they don't want to fight. They don't want conflict. They don't want headaches, right? The Devil in reverse. Ah, they had to break up with somebody. The Devil, it looks like. <laughs> uh, catching the vibe that it might be your friend. Judging by the fact that you have to let go of your friendship in order for this to move forward, right? Um... Well, the devil card is somebody who's very narcissistic. Somebody who's very deceitful. Somebody who does this thing. It's called uh, the flying monkeys, right? Or um, there's another word for it. It's a uh, smear campaigns, right? So what they do is they find as many lies as they can and they try to smear the image of somebody, right? Um, so I feel like whomever you're crazy about dealt with a really bad narcissist. And they had to let that shit go. They walked away. Um, because these are both in the reverse. It's like past energy. They're over it. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune. Shit changed for them, right? The Wheel of Fortune, things are changing for you. Um, yeah, because they also discovered something in regards to this person. That's fucking crazy, okay? That's fucking crazy. It's like you both discovered something about this person. You guys both know the same guy. Got the moon, the moon. Maybe this is somebody who really um, has an affinity for the moon. Because um, you're the Leo, you're the sun, you're the opposite. 
Um, and so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's interesting. Ace of Wands in reverse. Um, yeah, they're not starting any new love cycles at this moment because of what they went through. Um, it's like their change was, I'm not going back into another cycle with this devil. <laughs> I learned what I needed to learn. I discovered what... They're healing, right? They're healing right now. That's the energy I'm seeing. Um, all right. So what was discovery? Okay, I tried to fall out twice. Three of Wands! Yes, third party situation. Somebody was a cheater. That's what was discovered. Somebody was unfaithful as fuck. Um, fucking interesting, right? Um, looks like it fucked both of you up. Because you were their friend. You were close to them. You trusted them, right? You trusted them. But you're sitting in the King of Wands in the upright, saying that you're in your full power. You can see through bullshit. Interesting. Um. I don't know. Maybe you noticed a little extra present under the tree at Christmas. Maybe you noticed that this person was getting a lot of gifts while they were still with this other person. And you're like, hmm, that is weird, right? And having weird excuses for it, being at work the late hours. You started discovering something here, right? Um, you started kind of seeing through the bullshit, right? You started noticing the narcissism, right? The pitting people against each other. The trying to do the smear campaigns and make somebody look bad and trying to paint themselves as a perfect fucking angel, right? Well, the devil is an angel, so <laughs> I guess there's that. Um, Alright, so I feel like both of you are cutting this fucking guy out, or girl. I say guy because the queen of, uh, what was it, queen of cups, queen of love over here. Yeah. It's the feminine energy to counter yours. So it could be a guy or a girl, but that's the energy I'm seeing. Um, all right. So what's in store for you guys? Okay, the high priestess. So, you guys are really going to start listening to your uh, intuition. I say you guys because you're both going to. You're really going to listen to that third eye. You're really going to tap into your natural abilities, right? Um, and then we have the ten of cups in reverse, right? Not the lovers in reverse, which is a good sign. Not some. I feel like your queen of cups is going through a breakup, right? Somebody she had kids with. Right? Uh, or he had kids with. Because you see those kids in the background. Something has to end here. The number 10 is all about ending a cycle. Cups is all about love. Right? So we're ending a love cycle here. Um. What does Leo not know? I feel like you've got figured out a lot, but what do you not know? Right?
Okay, so you have the King of Wands in the upright. And we have the King of Wands in the reverse. So it's like there was an imposter here. Like somebody who tried to pose as you in some situation. Or tried to take on your energy. Tried to, but they were like a fake version. Like a, a fucking knockoff brand version of you. Right? They tried to embody you in some ways. Right? Um, they were imbalanced. They couldn't hold on to shit. Right? With this Page of Pentacles in reverse. They weren't actually sitting in your energy. <laughs> Nine of Swords. Yeah, they were shady, sneaky, lying. They were... Or Seven of Swords, sorry. Um, they were shady, sneaky, lying. They, were, they had that knife. They were ready to stab somebody in the back. And you see them being illuminated by the moon there? Like, yeah. Ten of Wands in reverse. Somebody had to walk away from them because they discovered that. They discovered the bullshit, right? And they were like, this fucking ain't working. <laughs> Eight of Cups, yeah. They just left that fucking burning and they're just like, goodbye. They walked away from it. Um, well, that's interesting. Maybe somebody hasn't walked away yet, right? Because we have the energy of somebody did walk away. Somebody isn't walking away, right? Ten of Wands in reverse. Coming to a conclusion here. It's like the fire sign. You. You're the one struggling to walk away from this, right? With the chariot in reverse. and But your Queen of Cups did, right? She just fucking, she's like, fine, bye. Whatever. This is whatever. <laughs> yeah, Two of Swords. It's like, in order to keep the peace, you were just, like, keeping that blindfold on, right? You didn't want to see the shady, sneaky, lying, manipulative energy, right? Um, and then with the Seven of Pentacles, I see something growing here, right? Something's coming up to the surface. Give it a second. All right, sorry. I was doing an assessment. <laughs> um. Man, this is, uh, crazy. Um, alright. So what's in the future for Leo? Um, I get the sense that you want to walk away. It's in your head. It's in your heart. You want to cut this off. Something's holding you up. I don't know why, but that song, um, Backstabber by the Dresden Dolls just came into mind. Backstabber, backstabber, da, 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 da. I don't know, that's like, I feel like that's the, that's your song, that's what you're feeling right now, you know, <laughs> like, you're, you're just feeling like, wow, we all got stabbed in the back here, right? It's like, you sacrificed your fucking self for the devil. Very nice, congratulations! <laughs> Sorry, I'm being a dick. Um, well, you know, it seems like it was a personal choice here. Um, and that's why I am being, the way I'm being about it. Okay, so what's next? Knight of Pentacles in reverse, not looking for a new job, not looking for new money. It's not on the job front. The hanged man in reverse. Obstacles will be removed. Um, the path will be clear for you. Yeah. 
almost out of time, so let's try to wrap this up very quickly. Um, all right. That's some advice for Leo before we go. Ten of Swords, walk away, cut it off. The Sun, this is you, that's the Leo card. Prosperity, happiness, abundance. That's what's going to come if you do it. Ten of Pentacles, being able to have that family life you always dreamt about, right? It's like, if you want this, if you want to live in the Sun rather than under the Moon, under that shady shit, 